Go to episode two. Life is strange. Play episodes. Play episode two. Out of time. Here we go. Oh, I love this game. I hope episode two is good, or is as good as episode one. Episode of Life is strange. Whoa. What the fuck? But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk to me. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No. <laughs> For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. Don't insult me. Max. Go Warren. On. We love hey, Warren. Leave oh. him alone. Rip Max? Warren. Chloe? It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Welcome home, Max. That's Rip Warren, you guys. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Something happened to her. Wait! Is it grass? Tell me the truth. That's an order. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Max, tell me everything. Oh man, so good. Alright. Story-based game that features player choice, consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. I will. I hope at least, I don't know. I just go with my gut on a lot of these. Alright, let's... Hit the snooze button. This action will have consequences. The music in this game is pretty great. It's very appropriate. Life is Strange, Episode 2. Shut up, Q. I'm playing a game. Space to get up. I am so wrecked after staying up all night. I could use my rewind to catch a few more Zs, but maybe I better save my strength. Alright, let's go ahead and get up. I wonder how long I can sit there for. Let's move along, though. Let's not be late. No amount of rewind will keep me clean. I still need a shower. Uh, I don't think I want to make the bed. I'll leave the music on. But let's take a selfie. No smiling. Take your power seriously. I stay taking selfies. Shut up, Q. Oh, hey, let's continue to water the plant. Drink up. It's got electrolytes. It's got what plants love. This action will have consequences. I told you, Red. I water the plant, and this action has consequences. Uh-oh. I wonder if I'll ever wear a watch again. Well, you can put it on now. No, I guess not. Good morning, clothes. I hope you slept well. <laughs> now, shall I be my Gucci shirt with a Vuitton jacket? She's so awesome. Alright, let's see what kind of text we've got. 
Alright, let's see what all this said. Breakfast is a go. You there? Like I said, always for you, smiley smiley. No emoji, frowny. Meet me at the diner in 40. I'll be there. Do not be late or I'll know time is not on your side. After all, you did let step dork bust me. That was with the, uh, the reefer. On my way, Smiley. You are evil. 40 minutes or else. Okie dokie. Even with all this crazy Q, shit going on, stop it's it. so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Alright, let's, uh, like, let's... no time. Okay, oh, I Max, didn't mean to cut her let's off. hit the showers now. I will make the bed. I, I will so make the bed. I am so not a rebel. I always like my bed to be neat and tidy. Thanks, Mom. There we go. Alright, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Do not forget I need those papers before tonight. Like, now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'm oh, hey, our new friend. We made friendly earlier. Ow! Oh, damn it. One quick rewind and I could stop this TP attack. That's true. I could. Whoops. Let's do it. Oh, Ow. damn it, I missed. Ugh. Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. <laughs> wow, now that was close. Thank you, Max. I keep doing that for her. She, like, she doesn't even... Oh, I got my butterfly again. Am I not going into the bathroom? Where the hell am I going right now? We shouldn't be watching this. Everybody's seen go. it by now. What is this? Whatever they're watching must be hot stuff. There's Brooke looking smarter than everybody. There we go. Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria, as usual. Map. Welcome to Black Hill. Where's the bathroom? Like, where do I go to take a shower? Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. I don't want to leave the girls' dormitories, I don't think. I want to go take a shower. What are you doing? What's happening, Dana? Everything cool? Oh, yeah, just refresh. Right? I'm oh, here. Yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, the best and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's Ooh. awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. <laughs> uh, I'm not big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Yeah, let's do it. Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a raid. Yeah. It does sound like fun. Now I have to go contemplate my party future. I'm making friendlies. Hmm. Hmm. What was that, paper ball? This is both sad and pathetic. Okay, I suck at writing, but I thought I should write this so you might not hate my dumb ass forever. I know I act like a tough jock around everybody, but I never had to act around you. I'm not the kind of man you deserve. You saw how I post out. If you need any money, let me know. XO Logan. Ugh. Logan needs to chill. Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. Okay. Where the hell is the shower? That's where I'm going, right? Maybe I have to leave the dormitories. No brook here. Yeah, maybe I just have to leave. That's where I'm going. Meh. 
Fine, I won't disturb you. Yeah, let's just move along. Oh, showers. Boom. I'm a genius. I knew it. I knew it was there the whole time. Oh, no. It's the girl that we left. Poor Kate. She's the only person I've hurt that I felt bad about. Oh, but I had I'm... a reason. Hey, Kate. Sorry about yesterday. Yeah, I'm sorry you didn't do anything to help. But you're just like everybody else here. What could I have done? It's not true. I wanted to help, but... But... Whatever. It's done. What could Finally, I have Max, done? Do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. All right. Shower time. Close your eyes, boys. All right, now you can report me, Hugh. There you go. Reported. GG, guys. Her. That's it. The video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Ugh, these two are the worst. Yuck! I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Max Selfie thought she was a badass taking that picture. I should have beat her down. Bring it on. That was so uncool. She's jealous because Mark, Mr. Jefferson, knows I'm going to win the Everyday Heroes contest. He thinks Max is a joke. Ugh, I hate, I hate her. I hate her. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave a link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. Ugh, <laughs> the worst. Kate'sVIP.com Kate'sVid.com Well, time to erase that. I better get dressed than go give back Kate's book. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Boom. Hello? Water? Sorry. I forgot. <sighs> Oops. I forgot about the water pressure. The last time I got a flu shot, I got the flu. Fuck you. Duh. Rachel is a whore. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's go get that book. I drew. If I'm able to, I'm not sure. Whoa! Uh, no what fucking is this? way! This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up? Wow! After I find Kate's book. Wow! Okay. Oh, she's in so much trouble. And nothing here. Oh my god, I'm so angry right now. <sighs> of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. Rewind, Better rewind. Fix this fast. Kate needs the book and I don't want to add to her list of problems. 
Rewind. Boom. Be gone, foul soft drink. <laughs> Aha, you sneaky book. You're mine. Alright, now what's the deal with this? Ta-da! I do love a clean room. Very zen. Except for that bullshit. Oh shit. Nathan's revenge. Even Chloe told me not to go to the principal. Victoria, of course. That's what I get for making fun of her. Bitch. I got a text message from mom. Hey honey, hope you didn't forget to water the plant we gave you, but don't drown it either. Mommy. Alright. Am I gonna drown it? What if I- oh boy. Now I'm nervous about that. Get dressed. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same exact suit for every day of the week. And he couldn't even rewind time. Alright, let's GTFO. Oops. Now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your ass. I know where you sleep. Oh shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. But it could- Hey Brooke. Oh. Hi, Max. You look distracted. Everything cool? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll Warren! We love Warren here. Warren's the man. Oh yeah, we have to go by uh, Kate's room. Which one's Kate's room? Do we remember? Kate's room. Boom. Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. You guys love that sign, right? <laughs> Damn it. Kate! Rip Kate. Um... Hey, Warren is bae. I brought your book. <laughs> Max, why didn't you do anything when David harassed me yesterday? I wanted proof David was in your face. I thought he was different. I'm happy to see that somebody cares. <laughs> Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Oh man, how do we want to approach this? How do we want to approach this with her? She's a fragile butterfly. Let's just... Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but... Tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of That's it. That's not that bad. Oh man, these choices. Let's just let's just console her. We're cool. That's we like awful. her. Awful. So, how did that happen? It's a long story. I'm still trying to sort it all out. We want to make friends, to except for the blonde that. and that asshole what guy. What at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. I believe her. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I believe you. I take a you. sip at church, and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Ugh. Nathan Prescott? Oh shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. That guy's He's never the nice. opposite of nice. Exactly. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. Then I woke up in a room. 
I, I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. So, Damn. who took the video of you at the party? I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Jim the Jerk, what's Thanks, up, Max. man? You can put my book here near my bag. Will do, Kate. This is some heavy shit all of a sudden. What a way to start off, uh... Episode 2. There we go, we so got Max, your book back. Can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Yeah. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. I need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Should I go to the police? Oh, man. Hell yeah. Yes, you should definitely go to the police, Kate. I totally believe every word you say. Nathan Prescott is truly dangerous. He is. Bless you, Max. I will go to the police. No. And also Principal Wells. Not Principal Wells. If he was my backup witness, they'll have to take us seriously now. Oh, backup no. Backup witness? Well, I mean, I believe you in everything, but we're still just spoiled punk students to the cops and faculty. I just think we need to be very careful here. Why? Careful of what? Nothing. Except the Prescotts are a powerful family. I hope this won't backfire on us, that's all. Even though that rich bastard has earned some serious bad karma. He'll get it. This game is awesome. I've only played episode one so far. I'm in the middle of episode two. It's kind of like a choose your own story type of game. Like... Time out, Max. You actually told Kate to go to the police and the principal. After getting a scary text threat. Now the police will definitely drag you into this shit. Shit. How do I stop? I don't want to rewind anymore. Oh my god. Controls. Rewind is right mouse button. How do I stop rewinding? Uh. All right, we're going to have to skip. Yeah, 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 everything. Everything uh, affects what's going on. I'm going to say go to the police. Screw it. I'm sticking with everything I said. Yeah, every single choice. You'd, like, watering my plant affects my, uh, like, Why what goes on. Why did she cover up the mirror? She can't look at herself? That's a lot of tears. She's going to go through boxes. Oh, take a photo. Absolutely. I take photos of everything. It's like, uh, it's like the Telltale games. Ouch. She left out Amnation. Oh, boy. Good lord. This Whoa. must be Kate's H.R. Geiger period. Yeah, this one is really good. Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. Kate's I'm trying to look for like. Immaculate. I'm looking for, her, for evidence. This must be a pigsty. Yeah, that's exactly what this game is like. Bible, photo. All right. Is there anything on our tablet? Kate is all alone dealing with this video bullshit. I hope her mother doesn't disown her. 
Jeez. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's go to the diner now. We gotta go meet up with Chloe. Oh, there it is. Chloe's texting me. Max, food. Two whales. See you there. Don't hurt your fingers texting. Yay, breakfast. No emoji. Apparently, Chloe hates emojis, and Max is a fan. Let's get out of here. <clears throat> yeah, episode one of this game was amazing. Episode two, it's getting started. We'll see how much, how it goes. The birds are flocking around Samuel. Hey, hey Samuel. Samuel. You're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. I do love the early morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. I can't tell if this guy's creeping me out or not. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. That's serial killer talk. What animals do you see in the forest? Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Sure, I did. Like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. There's nothing weird there except you saw yours. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? My spirit animal is a squirrel. I still can't tell if this guy's threatening or not. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. Third person. Okay. I Bye, so Samuel. don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Whoa. We gotta be cool to that guy. Release the Kraken. Come on, squirrels. It's time for your 15 minutes of fame. Ooh. I better not get near the bench, or the squirrel won't take the food. Did I just make a huge mistake? Can I go and get a picture now? Yep, there we go. Get a photo. Yes. Awesome. Another Pulitzer for the portfolio. Woo. Oh, hey, I got an achievement for that. Can't Blackwell have at least one no football zone? Who is this? Let's go investigate. Taylor. Hi, Taylor. Why would you even talk to me after the shit you pulled yesterday with Victoria? She deserved it. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk. For once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment, so talk. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. And she's bossy, too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you could have. Good morning, Rikoro. I guess I've had mean bossy parents, Ready for round two, too. man? Better than having mean bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. Let's rewind that. Whoops. Hi, Taylor. Why would you even talk to me? I've heard that your mother was sick. I'm so sorry. Boom. What what happened to her? Well, if you do care, my mom had back surgery. Victoria was there for me. Like you are for Kate. I'm not about tearing people down, Max. I know. That's why I wanted to talk. I'm glad we did. Awesome. I'm making friendly with everybody except for Victoria and oh no. This is Nathan's father. 
slander and blackmail my son will be met with many lawyers and legal ramifications. Consider this a final polite warning. Yes, I can control time. Max, it's, it's pretty freaking cool. So if I screw up, I can go back and change what I did, or um, if I learn new information, I can go back and inject that new information into something, or not. I can do whatever I want, basically. Max, come on over here. All right, come Warren. On. Warren is Bay. We love oh, Warren. Nothing. Waiting for a call? I mean, I already took the call. Anyway. I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. By the way, thank you for stepping in. You were pretty badass, Warren. Yeah, he was. I owe you. Warren oh, was the yes, man. Oh, yes, you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. Yo, Xander, what's You're up, man? You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully, and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl, she's pretty punk rock. How do you know her? I know, I saw that. I saw that like two minutes before, uh, before I started streaming. An old friend, Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a while. I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Hell yeah. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Alright, do we want Warren involved? We, who have we told already? We told Chloe. We love Warren, right? Hmm. Do we trust Warren? I think we trust Warren. Oh, man. What if he's like... I'm getting these anonymous text messages, you know, like... Let's, uh, let's just go for it. Let's trust him. I busted him in a bathroom yesterday with a gun. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. Weird fucking week. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday. Speaking of dystopia, that driving is having right, a cool. 70s there we go. of the Apes marathon. Let's go ape! Yes. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool. I'll text you the info. Thanks, Warren. We like Warren. Yeah, Jim, this game is awesome. It's, uh... It's really freaking good. The first episode is so intense. This one's been pretty chill so far, but... David I imagine it'll probably pick up. A good thing. This has something to do with Kate. Or Rachel. And you guys, I think I might cancel H1Z1 for after this and uh, check out all this new CSGO stuff because a huge patch was released. So after this, I think I'm going to play some CSGO because I want to see all this operation, uh, the new operation they released and all the new skins and all that. Yeah, Rekora was here for episode one. If anyone wants to watch my uh, playthrough of episode one, it's in my highlights. So you guys, uh, if you're not caught up, you can get caught up. It's like, I think it's like an hour, maybe an hour and a half. Oh, nice. <laughs> I'm still at Nova Master. I keep seeing that, uh, the lighthouse in the background. The one from my dreams, or my uh, flash forwards, I don't know what they are actually. 
with the tornado. Alright, we're at the two whales. Time to go meet up with Chloe. Our insane... Talk about going back in time. The diner looks exactly the same. Pot smoking friend. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Good morning. Who's this guy? Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard it has. <laughs> Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. You did pretty good to have lasted this long. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. Later. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They might rename the town Prescott Bay, if that tells you much. Screw the Prescotts. Do you know them? Do good for Let's my get some work. Dick guy. Or some dirt I on know them. them through their bad deeds. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. <laughs> I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. What do you want, Chloe? I'm outside. Jeez, slow down. Yes, we are open. Who's this jabroni? Excuse me, sir? Can you believe this town? The world is on fire, and our big headline is snow. I can hardly wait for next week's big story. Clouds. The snow was pretty odd. It was right in the middle of a warm, sunny day. Oh, global warming bullshit. It's the Northwest. Snow happens. <laughs> I keep reading how Arcadia Bay is booming. The paper can only talk about that or about missing girls. You mean Rachel Amber? I guess. I bet she ran away because she was bored. Who wouldn't be here? Jeez, this guy. Weather service baffled by snow. The snow came out of nowhere. I think I had something to do with it, though. Man, that smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware ugh, makes me feel 13 again. All right, where are you at, Chloe? What's up, Trevor? Hey, Trevor. Holla, Max. By the way, Holla. you saw me at the dorm. Yeah, I saw you coming out of Dana's room. Yeah, and I finally had to tell Justin because, well, he was into her too. How did Justin react? I got him blazed. He was <laughs> cool. Nobody has secrets in Blackwell anyway. See you in class, Max. 420 blaze it with Trevor and Justin. All right. Let's, uh, let's have a seat. Where's Chloe? Chloe's tripping somewhere. That's what she's doing. And there she is. A lovely young woman. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. Who are you? It's nice to see you again. Joyce. You look the same. <laughs> like I'm still a waitress at Two Whales after all these years. No, like you still look pretty. Nice save, kid. You're still smart. But I wish you'd been here to help save Chloe. She got busted yesterday smoking out. Again. I know. Chloe told me that her stepfather hit her. I am sorry that was your introduction to David. I hope you get to know him on your terms, not Chloe's. He's a good man. He just... Yeah, I'm He's sure he douche. is since he married him, but... Don't be so harsh on Chloe. It's good you're here. I was hoping you could be a good influence in her life now. I will be. Promise. So I guess that's I know Chloe's things mom. were hard for you and Chloe. 
I feel bad I didn't call. Now my folks are in Seattle and I'm all alone at Blackwell. It's my karma. You did the right thing. You moved forward with your life. I did after William passed on. Chloe? Chloe chose to stay angry. Anyway, I hope we see more of you. Chloe needs an old friend again. Joyce, I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. I'm glad, Max. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Even if Chloe doesn't understand yet. Uh, does she understand? Chloe understands. She just needs time. I know that sucks for you. Oh, she hit all the phases. Expulsion, running away, drugs, bad boys, tattoos, piercings, blue hair. <laughs> now she's got to rebel against her stepfather. Her stepfather is a I dick. I see why, I mean. Why? What did Chloe tell you? Well, Chloe texted me that David slapped her yesterday. He feels awful, and he will be punished. But Chloe does push David, and it's not fair. He paid his dues in a war. He does care about her, along with all the students at Blackwell. No, no. Let's get he in on this. He cares about Kate Marsh. David mentioned her, but I stay out of his business. I won't patrol Blackwell, and he won't cook at the diner, you know? Yesterday, I took a picture of him fighting with Kate. I thought you might know why. Nice try, Nancy Drew. But next to you, there's only one student I'm worried about. And she's not even in school anymore. Hmm. So, now let's get down to the nitty gritty. What do you want I'm gonna, to eat? I'm gonna bust this guy. He's such a douche. Do we want a bacon omelet or a Belgian waffle? I'm sure it's gonna matter. Let's see. Oh, I have a deer. Or a, yeah, I have a doe or a deer or whatever on my shirt. That's kind of neat. Let's go bacon omelet. I was I dreaming some eggs. about your bacon omelet. Now finish your coffee. <clears throat> oh, I love omelets. Now I want one. Like, legitimately want an omelet. Alright, what are we looking at? One bacon omelet for the young lady staff. Graffiti. Nerd graffiti. Warren must have been here. Waffle height? I love oh, the delicious late. anticipation of breakfast. Let's drink our coffee. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. I keep going back in time. Can I get some beer and bacon before I die? This is a diner, not a bar. The only thing that's changed on the menu are the prices. Mmm. Oh my god, I love food. No beer? <laughs> Looks like you had plenty. Stick with the bacon. The lighthouse looks so mysterious. I wish I could stay in this moment forever. Take a picture. That's I guess I actually can now. But then it wouldn't be a moment. Alright, let's drink some more coffee. Incoming. This is like fourth dimensional deja vu. Uh -huh. You'll love this. Oh, here we go. I'm drooling like a baby. Mm. Still can't believe you're a woman. When I look at pictures of Chloe, oh. Yeah, oh, omelets. <laughs> Speak of the devil. There she is. What's up, blue hair? Yeah, with the, Mom and Max, with the stoners. Again. And Chloe looking for a free meal. You put your whole damn college fund on your tab. I'm treating Chloe for breakfast. No, you're not. This is my treat to you for coming back to rescue my daughter. Nobody needs to rescue me. Unless you set your room on fire smoking out. Oh god, here it comes. Didn't you and Sergeant Pepper already read me the riot act last night? Call him Four twenty blazing. don't want to be lectured. You only get one damn slice of bacon a day. Ooh. That's harsh. You guys are still the same. Another reason to blow this town. What is this shit on the jukebox? Now You'll rescue her. <laughs> Let's talk about your superpower. Yeah. I don't have any explanation, and I can't explain why I saw that crazy fucking tornado. Come on, that's just a daydream. I want proof you can rewind time. 
This is all happening so fast. Yeah, Let's I told her that I can okay, rewind now. time. It's like a known I thing in the storyline. Every thing you have in your pocket. You have X-ray vision, dude? I don't even know what's in my pocket. Let me see. Okay, Max. Impress me. Uh. Your car keys. No, oh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Um. I don't know. Do you have some kind of power or not? Okay, psychic girl. Let me show you what's actually in my pocket. Here we go. Now we're gonna learn. All right, let's record this to memory. That was beyond epic fail. You even made me want to believe you. All right, here we go. Okay, Max. Study every item carefully and don't forget anything. Panda keychain. Seven cigarettes. 75, 80, 84, 86 cents. Seven cigarettes, 84 cents, a panda keychain. And a ticket out of Parking Bay, Twin Peaks, Franklin Street. Okay, here we go. Let's go back in time. Writing it in chat. <laughs> awesome. It was 86 cents. It was 86 cents. You're screwing me up. All right, here we go. What the hell? Okay, Max. I'm there we go. Ready. All right, so you have cigarettes? I'm pretty sure you have cigarettes on you. Yes, you know I'm a smoker. But how many cigarettes? Seven. Seven cigarettes. A superpower that allows you to count cigarettes. Cool. Amazing. Oh, come on. Something else in my pockets? Keys. Your car keys. Duh, way too easy. I need details. Describe my keychain. Panda. A cute robot panda keychain. Not bad, Supermax. You do have that Irish luck, Caulfield. What else? Money. Hmm. Some money. Clearly I'm rich as fuck. How much do I have? <laughs> 86 cents. 86 cents. That's right, living large in Arcadia About Bay. tree fitty. So that was cool. Show me more. You have a parking ticket. A parking ticket. You know me well. But what is the exact time I was busted? 10.34 a.m. 4 a.m. Booyah! Good Max call, Xander. What? Amazeballs. I literally just got chills all over my neck. That's right. You have powers. I'll take that crap off the table, Chloe. Sure, Mom. How's the food, Max? Better than I remembered. Very good mm. save. Man, I'm hungry like the wolf. Clearly. The chills for, for me. I'm freaking out about what just happened. Damn, you Xander. You have to show me more. Something way cooler so I will believe you without any doubt. Okay. I will predict the future. No way. Yeah, 86. Thank you, now, Law. pay attention to everything that happens in the next few moments so you can dazzle Chloe with your mad power. All right, all right. Oops. Did you that guy drops his mug. Cup? Really? No oh, refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my park? Cop leaves. Don't slap me, bitch. Take and then the Trevor outside. gets a fight. He started it. I'm finishing it. And she finishes the fight. What else? Oh. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage.
I think our jukebox is headed for deep. And the Jones jukebox Clark. breaks. So what are you waiting for? Now I should rewind and tell Chloe everything that just happened. All right. Here we go. I'm going to predict four events that will happen in the next 30 seconds or so. All right, here we go. Uh, trucker drops his mug. The trucker drops his mug and Joyce rips him a new one. So what happens next? And alert on the cops radio and his partner leaves. The cop gets an emergency alert on his radio, and his partner in the car leaves without him. Well, let's just see how this goes down. Justin, Trevor, and Joyce stops them. Justin and Trevor are fighting, and Joyce breaks it up. This is getting good. Can't wait to see what happens. And then finally... Oh... I don't know. Which one was it? Was it... Oh, uh, the trucker didn't get up to play a new song, did he? Damn it. The jukebox goes crazy as the trucker tries to play a new song. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything Was it the fly? Like Oh, whatever. All right. Was it the fly? Oops. Boom. Dude, Did you, you right? break another cup? Really? No oh, refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where's my party? You're a oh, dick. Don't so cool. me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. All right. Was it a fly? You started it. I'm finishing it. That is wild. It's a cockroach. It was a cockroach. This is a sad day in Mexico. This is sure the hell better than that other garbage. I think our jukebox is headed for Daisy Jones's locker. Damn it. So what are you waiting for? Now I should rewind and tell Chloe everything that just happened. All right. We missed one, so it's going to make us go back and get everything right. It's OK, though, because we can fast forward. All right, speak. I'm going to... Trupper, trucker drops his mug. So... And then... Partner leaves. The cop... And then... Well, Joyce breaks it up. And then... He's getting good. The cockroach. Boom. The jukebox goes crazy as a cockroach crawls on it. All right. Pretty bizarro, Max. But let's see if everything happens like you said. There we go. See, now we have a different uh, perspective. Oops. Did you break another cup? Oh, wait really? Go, Mom. No refill for you. Shh. And now I gotta take this call and leave my breakfast. Hey, where is my partner? You called it. But he's off to go bust some skaters. You're a dick. Don't slap me, bitch. Take your fight club outside. He started it. I'm finishing it. Trevor and Justin must be in love. That. I pledge allegiance to Max and the power for which she stands. This isn't a toy, Chloe. I do have to be careful how I use it. Screw that! Of course it's a toy! The best toy ever? You can bang anyone with no strings attached, rewind time, and boom! It's like it never happened! That's not oh. me, though. Maybe you made a move on me and I would never know. Yes, that's what I did. You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. I don't have time. That You did not just say that. That was so punny. Uh, check out your nose. Too much blow? What's going hey, on? Hey, are you okay? Too much excitement. See what happens when we hook up again? Then oh, let's I'm go broken. to one of my secret lairs and fully test your power. You need a sidekick to guide you. Okay, girl wonder. Show me the way to Chloe's cave. All right. I guess we're gonna go hang out with Chloe. Chloe finally believes me, and I wonder what kind of crazy shit she has in mind now. T 
t-shirt. Do I really want to talk to any of these weird lady? Let's talk to the weird lady. Hello there to you. Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh, oh yeah, boy. It's going to be a super day. Okay Is there, eh? Royal Canadian Mounted Police there, eh? All right, let's GTFO. Chloe. Let's okay, bail. Supergirl. Let's go to my secret place. Yeah, it's Dorothy like the butterfly effect. We have places to go and what we do. Come on, before mom starts some more shit, let's bail. It's Kate Marsh from Blackwell. Big whoop. You don't call me once in five years and now you're all over some biatch you see every day at school? I see how you roll. So go ahead, chat up Kate Marsh from Blackwell. I've got other people to hang out with too. Uh, I'm answering it. Kate Marsh is in some trouble. Chloe's acting like a crazy person. Don't care, Chloe. Hey, Kate. What's up? Please, don't let your best friend get in the way. You okay? I promise, Kate. I won't forget. I swear. Just do your homework and don't stress. I really don't think we should go into this right now. I'll call you later, okay? There we go. Easy. It took two seconds. Thanks, Max. If you'd rather chill with Kate, please. Chloe! You are ridiculous. I'm chilling with you, okay? For now. Let's rock. Why act like a crazy person? It's a phone call. It's a two second phone call. It sucks that Chloe and Joyce got into an argument. I could rewind and not answer Kate. It's not like I won't see her in class later. False. I'm sticking with my decision. Oh boy. That's not good. Some decisions I might go back and think differently about, but that one, I am sticking to that decision. Is this a race? Keep up. How many times are you going to get pissed at me this week? That depends on you. And no, this well game's you awesome, this phase of the Muscle. Test. Welcome to American Rust, my home away from hell. Raw and rough. It suits you. Max, do you know how awesome this is? I get my best friend back, and she's also super-sized? We don't know for how long. Exactly why it's time to have fun. Okay. I love this soundtrack. David might be Whoa. a douche, but you did steal his gun. Is Whoa! everybody armed in Arcadia Bay now? Only the ones who shouldn't be, like Step Dildo. Until now. I'm not in the revolution yet, Che. You ah. are the revolution, Max. So we should figure out how to best use and abuse your power with a test. What kind of test? Drink? Yuck. You are so cute. You haven't changed a bit. Okay, let's do this. Can you find five bottles while I prep the shooting range? Beer what? and guns? <laughs> Nice combo. You can handle it. Now go find us five bottles, pretty please. Chloe, why are you such a crazy person? Why am I hanging out with you? Can't reach? Maybe can reach? Stupid bottle. Can I just... Rewind and... Look what we have here. A cute little bottle for the taking. Oh, there we go. Boom. Genius. And now... I can step up and grab it easy. There you go. Hello, bottle number one. Four more to go. I'm in a freaking junkyard. At this point, I'd rather go hang out with Crazy Chloe than, uh... Those shells look fresh. Or Crazy Kate than Crazy Chloe. Why are all my friends crazy? I, how, I... Yeah, I can alter time and all, but how am I the normal one in this? Another the Bigfoots were here. this way heavier than I thought Ugh. 
Oh. Well, did you look at that? Crafty. Boom. Only three bottles. All right, Jim. Have a good night, man. What is this? Oh, Warren. Thanks, Warren. Warren is totally bay. And I don't know why Dylandu would come here and try to give spoilers on the last episode when the last episode's not even out yet, bro. So, uh... Either way, for the spoilers, or assumed spoilers, I don't know what you're doing. You got timed out, bro. I, but, welcome oh, to the channel. I hope you have fun. They left you here all alone. Baby. Where are the rest of these bottles? Ooh, maybe something in here? This looks like a graffiti museum for Chloe and Rachel. I bet Rice. I can find out more about Rachel here. Okay. That kind of hurts. I can't see Chloe playing with makeup. They really were besties. That could have been me instead of Rachel. Damn, that train. Another bottle. Three down, two more to go. Talk about finding a bottle in a haystack. Right? I want to die. Jeez. Who wrote this? So Rachel did go to a Vortex Club party. Hmm. This flyer is dated right before she disappeared. Interesting. They would have gone all the way to Los Angeles for a rave. Looks fun. Does it? Right, let's see what we've got out here. Whoa, whoa! Things are falling on me. Campfire, hey, bottle. Take. Four. One more bottle to go. Okay, okay. I'm sure this is a popular party pet. Kate. You want great advice for going to the police and telling them everything about Nathan. I appreciate you standing by me. Kate, I'm on your side. Don't mention me too much. I'm already in trouble around here. Thanks so much for talking to me this morning. About to have a serious cry. I needed a friend, and I was there as usual. Boom! Making friendly. I'm trying. Oh my god! Alright, let's get past this. Damn. That scared me. Boom, the next bottle. And I actually have to hit the bathroom. Well, now I can so, deliver this bottle booty to Captain Chloe. Before we do whatever the hell it is we're about to do with these bottles, I am going to hit the bathroom. So I will be right back. We're going to take a quick pause. Sorry, guys. Too much smoothie. <laughs> Okay, and I'm coming back. Sorry, I just drank a giant smoothie, like, right before the stream started. And I always have to pee after I drink those, because it's like 32 ounces of water, fruits, and vegetables. <laughs> Alright, where's Chloe? Where is this dummy? Car wreck. Yeah, this is what's about to happen here, I think. There she is. Alright, Chloe. Got your bottles. Thanks, Max. Wait, 
One more for the road. There we go. You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. What? Show me the way, Max. I need to see you shoot first. Okay. Oh! Alright. <laughs> Show me the way, Max. Right. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Boom! Woo! Oh, yes! We did, did it, stream! It, Max? Duh. That was so fucking cool! Now was for it? the second bottle. This is like the exact you know, Max, person where do I aim? who shouldn't I'm have a target. gun. Pull the trigger. Ooh, okay. Now, Max, where do I aim? Aim slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now that is fun. Let's pump up the volume and find me another target. I want to get creative here. Okay. Uh, I need something to shoot, Max. I guess shoot that. Aim at that old blue flank here. I hate old flanks. Woo! Yeah, that's America. Come on, Recoro. You must rid the world of those bottles. What? Why am oh, I rewinding Max, here? Rewind and help Chloe aim. Okay. Give me something to shoot, Max. Oh, what? Oh, that was a yawn. Okay. I bet you want to blow apart those old computer monitors. Fuck Let's that old plank. I agree. Woo! Old school. Lame. What the hell? I guess she's bored. All right. Give me. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now. I shoot the back band. That's what Chloe needs about. to get back band. Did you guys see that? Like never. So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target now? She gets back band. Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Shoot the gas tank. Shoot the windshield. I want to see that windshield go down. Watch out for flying glass. Ooh. <gasps> Poor squirrel. You guys oh, better no. run for cover! Rip squirrel. Yet the bottle remains. Oh, okay, that's what we're doing. We're doing trick shots to get the bottle. Okay. Well, then I guess the... Dude, I need a target before I shoot. This is a horrible idea. Let's see what happens when you shoot the gas tank. Step back. Gas tank go boom. Oh my god. Wait, did that really just happen? Car definitely down, but no bottle casualties. Uh feels good, but I didn't hit any of the bottles. Back up! Back Stupid up! Gun! Hold on, Chloe. We're making mistakes. Dude, I need a how about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. We are make. We're making mistakes. Dude, I need a. How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. We are make. Boom. Now that's MLG. Uber cool. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's Jeez. your turn to bust a cap. 
I don't know. Max, your nose. Damn. I'm freaking out. I don't feel so super. Max! Oh boy. We're back here again. Man, this dream is so intense. Go pick what up? What was on the ground? I must have missed it. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. <clears throat> Too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. I'm glad I feel normal again. We've been using it way too much. Chloe. Go pick up one on the ground. Wow, sir. That <gasps> looks exactly like the same dough from my tornado vision. Let's go investigate. Get the photo. I know it's like just a vision, but... Where are you going? No, come back! I opened another, or I just got another achievement. Come back! Oh, uh, okay. Why would I want to sit on the stump? so quiet and primordial out here. I always feel like the forest is whispering to me. Like Arcadia Bay is trying to tell me something. I just have to figure out the message. Oh no, you're cool, man. Yeah, for real. Alright, let's get up. Let's go, uh... Let's go chat up Chloe. We feel better now. Now that we've seen our deer, we got a picture. Had some time okay. to... Looks like you're ready to lock settle him up. back down. Let's go hang out with I Cracky don't again. I know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo, Max is afraid. I know you can handle this. And I'm here to Oh yeah, you. super hipster. Make me proud, sister. Oh my god. Who is this jabroni? Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, Who's sorry, Frank? Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Oh, boy. Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Oh, boy. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend, and it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back oh. before you regret it, girl. I mean it. Stand your ground. I cut you, bitch. Stand your ground. Stand your Please. ground. Please step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Stand your ground. This guy's got a knife. I'm standing my ground. That is hilarious. Oh, man. I'll remember you, kid. I'll remember you almost shot me. And you'll wish I had no memory because I never forget. Oh, boy. All right. We screwed up. We screwed up. We screwed up. Nope. You have until Friday to pay me. Nope. We're Don't going back. Don't pull crap like this again. It'll be the last time. We're going back. Try bullets next time, brainiacs. We're going back. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. Sorry. We screwed up. I think. You are awesome. Thanks for standing up for me. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Jesus, I almost shot this guy. And now he'll be more dangerous to Chloe and me. Nope. Nope. We're going back. We're going all the way back. Are you ready to do this? We should jet before. We have plenty of time to do anything we want, whenever we want. Make me proud, sister. Alright, let's jump to the decision. Don't shoot. Come on, girly. Shoot me. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Thanks. Oh no. No, that's perfect. You have until Friday to pay. That's me, perfect. Or I'll track you down with this interest. Oh no. Have a good play, kids. Maybe that's not perfect, but maybe it is because now he you has really the stolen gun. gun. I freaked. I don't like guns. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step shit will have his other gun sealed in an electrified bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held a gun on a human being before. Not cool. I know, Max. Really. I'm actually relieved it worked out this way instead. And there are more guns out there. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel Ooh. secret today. At least Frank oh, is gone. Boy. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Oh, man. Frank took Chloe's gun because of me. I'm not that big on Chloe right now. Wow, sir. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk about this later, but I better follow Chloe now. Chloe's waiting to go for a walk. Chloe's a bad influence we on We both me. need a timeout from here. Alright. Uh, do I want to keep that? Let's keep it. He has a stolen gun. We're fine. We're fine. It may work out. It may not I work out. You basically out. gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me, especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds I already up in left. My mind is people letting me down. And I just liked having that gun, man. You need to chill out. Now you have me to protect you. I'm just glad you were here. Me too. I think. Chloe, why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. <laughs> Feels like a different world. We've got world, some hype right? going on, channel. I wish we could stay forever. Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new I secret hangout. These, these tracks are active, okay? Are you okay, Max? We are laying on active train tracks. I'm still freaked out about what Yeah, happened. I'm doing one episode tonight. I'm going to do the, awful, Chloe. I'm the final episode that's but out Frank tomorrow night. Frank isn't as hardcore night. as he runs. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell oh. me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers. Obviously don't get my pot from you, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Hung out? Hung out? You don't mean you... Oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? Hmm. 
I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, okay? Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out yeah, this much since we were be. tweens. You're insane. No time has passed. I wish Rachel was here to meet you. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. That's what I do. I take Plus, pictures. she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as cool as you are. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. I like Kerouac. The sound of the train whistle at night. Look at the beat poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. I stay you taking are. pictures. You just have to stop being afraid. I don't know. Perfect. Oh no, I'm tripping balls again. I'm freaking out. Help! I got stuck! What a dumbass. Like, what kind of stuck? Like, you're gonna lose your shoe? Take your damn shoe off! What's that noise? Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. A train! You have oh, got shit. to be kidding me! Okay, uh, well, what, uh. Find something! Free me! What? <laughs> Find something, she says. What about. Come on. This? I okay. Can't even move it an inch. What about awesome. this? It's not locked. Uh. I better find a tool to cut those wires. Oh, are you kidding me right now? Well, gotta go find a tool. Crowbar. Crowbar's not gonna cut shit, but I'll take it. I can definitely use this bad boy. I can switch Get the... That's not gonna do anything though, is it? I, I don't think that's gonna do anything. For real? Oh boy. GG guys. It's, it's yeah. not gonna happen. Oh my god. Oh boy, that's so brutal. Alright, alright, alright. Jeez. Okay, 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 okay. Um, what the hell? I can't budge it at all. Let's go all, let's go way back. All right, use the crowbar. Uh, score. If I would have kept the, it didn't have any bullets left. Open the drawer, what do we have here? Boom. I'm gonna take those. Now I can pull a total MacGyver. What's in here? Nothing. What's in here? I've got plenty of time. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I've got all the time in the world. All right. There's nothing else in here. Damn. Something is blocking the drum. Okay. <sighs> Let's go back. Go back. Keep going back. We'll go back to here. Use the crowbar on the wedge. What is this gonna do? I don't know what this is gonna do, but we're about to find now out. Can finally move the drum. Push the drum. Oh! I have to help lift Chloe up. Oh my god! Wait, did that not happen? Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go, let's keep going back. Okay, okay, okay. We've got this. 
Wedge, crowbar, go. I know, right? If the if this thing would have killed her, oh man, it would have felt so bad. I was actually thinking that in my head too. I was like, oh, is that really gonna happen? All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I have to help lift Chloe up. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. We did it. And I got some pliers out of it. You saved me again. Crazy. You were totally wrong, right? You okay? I got splinters in my ass and legs, so I wish there was a less violent way for you to save me. And now the trains can't get to the lumber mill. Oops. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but Ugh. I have to get was back to cool? school before my next class. Since you're the Jeez. mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's so okay. Stop screwing up. We will. Forever. See, we're still BFF. I can screw her over, over and over and over and over again, and she's fine with it. Because she's crazy. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Probably. Up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Alright, Sea Muscle, have a good night, man. What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. You alter the course of my destiny, yours and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Alright, Sea Muscle, have a good night, man. What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! No, like let's you said, chill. Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. There we go. Time for art class. What photo I'm gonna use for my uh, my project? Oh boy, Vortex Club. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. Where do we want to wander to? Uh, this principal is an Sir? awful person. Oh, hello, Miss. I hope this isn't about the alleged gun incident. Alleged? Nathan did have a gun. Have you talked to him yet? Yes, he's deeply upset about this accusation. I don't blame him. Once I have all the facts, we'll talk. For the moment, focus on your schoolwork. I can't focus when I'm scared. Please don't say that. There's nothing to be scared of at Blackwell Academy. Our head of security is overseeing a new era of campus safety. Oh, boy. I saw Mr. Madsen hassle Kate Marsh yesterday. Wait, wait. Do you see a pattern here, Max? Probably not the same one you see. It's very easy for you to instantly accuse people of doing terrible things. Nathan, Mr. Madsen, who's next? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting. I have a picture. Max, I have a meeting. Excuse me. I'm gonna rewind and show him the picture then. Sir? Oh, hello, Max. A lead? Yes. I can't focus. Please don't. Here we go. Let me give me the option to show the picture. I saw Miss. Wait. Probably not. It's very. Oh, damn it. Okay. Whatever. These elite assholes throw a lot of big parties. I 
have a chance for Nathan evidence. Prescott to dose somebody. Maybe you owed money to Frank, too. You can really learn a lot about a school by the weird shit posted on the boards. Otter champion. New tablet to, for sale contains five gigabytes of cat pics. I would totally buy that. Oh, I took a picture. I don't, I don't want to talk to him. Screw that guy. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have Aww. to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I do. I'm not anti-soiree. You seem anti-fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Rude. Let's go back. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. I know, right? I just got hashtag burned. You care. I'm on this. I'm sure the Vortex Club has a dress code. As you can see, I would need your advice on what to wear. Boom! Thanks, Max. I didn't think you noticed high fashion. Of course I I'll do. Tell you what, I'll put you down on the guest list, and before the party, I can give you some tips. Cool. Thanks, Courtney. Being friendly. I'll send you the party info later. Back to the list. Hashtag making friends. Seriously. Hello, climate change. Who else is there? Trevor. Trevor smokes weed. Oh boy. Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? Do you mind if we talk about what happened yesterday with Chloe? You hit Chloe. I'm sure she told you why. Did she mention she probably stole Chow one Courtney. of my guns? <laughs> You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. But you treat Kate pretty bad. I shouldn't have said anything. You know about that video going around. Is that why you hassled Kate yesterday? I took a photo of that moment for surveillance sake. Soldier, you Boom. don't have the facts. You think I'm a hypocrite because I want cameras around here for the safety of the students? That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. This guy. Warren! In the sci-fi lab. See you soon. Yeah, Warren's I still have back. time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. Let's do it. That reminds me, I have to score some weed from Nathan. There we go, smoking weed. Why does everyone in this game smoke weed? No, I don't want to speak to her. Let's just go talk to Warren. What's up, Warren? Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. It's like my cat. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. <laughs> Fair enough, Spot. Let's, uh, let's go banana. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go... potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. I get a free hug from Warren. Oh my god. Weird science. Did that not work? Yes, I am a scientist. Fuck. Alright, it didn't work. I was wrong. Let's go back. Think, big brain. Think. I got hey, this. Warren. Maxwell's Let's jump ahead. Asking... Have that... I've got this. We're doing sodium. I oh, wait. have a vision. Go I had a new DM. I had a go new DM? answer. That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is. Let's see what sodium does. Damn, 
Nothing. Nothing. All right, yeah, yeah, we gotta go. We gotta this go. Can't be that hard. Hey, Max Warren. potassium. Let's skip forward. Ask. Have daddy. Lots of potassium. I actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a shitload. See? The Joe Look Dirt. Smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. Let's do this thing. That's some obscure movie. Uh. But oh. Hey, King Lord dude. Science. Yeah, I did. Yes, that was a blast. But let's keep it a professional secret. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Yes, so you have to say to me. That was a blast. Right. I don't get but a free hug. Let's keep it a professional secret. Cool. I was hoping I'd get a free hug out of I this. I don't want to laugh, but he looks so hilarious. Bring me the brain, Igor. <laughs> hey, babe, what's going on? Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? Yeah. I need to know if you can help me with a potassium experiment. Oh, wait. No can do, Max. I'm all about robotics, not chemistry. Give me a drone over a beaker. Fair enough. I'm helping Warren with his latest experiment. Oh, I guess he needed a neophyte assistant so he wouldn't be threatened. But you came to his rescue anyway. Apparently, it's my nature. Yet, Warren ignores the experts right in front of him. Not Sorry. that he would ask me for help, anyway. I'm his girl. Chill out. Why is everyone getting so angry? Alright, so... Bail? Bring me the brain. Yeah, we're bailing. We helped him. Wonder why they don't use real skeletons. Uh, so you can't stop acting me? so brittle. I'm trying, but you have to understand my position. Yo, why are you being well, mean to Kate? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Nobody. Kate. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos, but you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me, I'm worried about Kate Marsh. Yeah. You're not the only one. Do you have something you want to tell me? I saw David Madsen harassing Kate yesterday. He was scaring her. Mr. Madsen confuses fear with security. I I'm sorry. Kate had to be a target of his paranoia. If you had proof, I could talk to Principal Wells. Oh, yes. I have an actual photograph for once. Ooh. Let me see that photo after class. That was Rachel Skeleton? Like a real photographer. <laughs> and Max, I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral Oh, yeah. Video. I was dropping frames. It's good now, though, right? I'm back now. Yeah, yeah. Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She Whoa. means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. Blame the victim she there, sir. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support. Yeah, I dropped a few frames. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. It did happen. Nathan Prescott had a gun in the girls' bathroom yesterday. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. Right? Why would I'd like I? I'd to believe that, Max. It just seems like there's a lot of drama around you this week. Listen, should I... Excuse me, Max. Hello. Why is everyone yes. in this game King Douche? Uh, hold on. Except Warren. This, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Hmm? I wanna listen uh -huh. in. Alright, he's not gonna say anything. Stella! Stella is smart to stay out of all the drama. So. Dana, you are out of control. Hey, I'm kinda of doing something now, it? Max. Alright, fine. Like Here we go, Alyssa. I like Alyssa. She'll be so pissed if I take her photo, won't she? 
No, I'm just gonna do it. He does have gray hair. Boom. I take pictures. It's what I do. Oh, Not my marks. I'm contemplating shit. <laughs> She's awesome. What's up, Daniel? Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. Okay. Good for you, bro. Oh, really? Am I really gonna go talk to Victoria? No time to talk, Max. Posing in Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh, I'm sure she'll report us to the principal. Like I give a f Better <laughs> quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. And paparazzi. I want that photo whore or I get nasty. Too late. I'm standing up oh, for myself burn. here. burn. Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. As far as In I'm fact, concerned, it shit's is. just starting, Max. Oh my god, this guy looks like a Assholes. drug addict. He's the worst. What are they gonna do to me, though, huh? What are they gonna do? Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now, this is so wrong and weird. What in the hell? What can I do from here? Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's go back and get a photo of him taking a photo. Right? Damn it, I keep pressing that. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier, and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say, and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. I'll see we you have later. a lot to cover today. All right, Warren. So little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like so you're giggling rare. about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel. <laughs> what did I draw? Have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. What's this? No smartphones in class, Max. Oh. Put that away. Sorry. Usually, people need something to judge, so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality. It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photo tips. TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves. I guess Kate will miss class now. I'm so worried about her. There are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Like Max Caulfield, I'm one for of them. example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying Kiroskiro. That'd be a good call spot. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Although we don't technically see in my- Yo! Some crazy shit is going down in the girl's dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Okay. Listen. Everybody remain seated. Wow, we all just bailed. Dismissed. Interesting. Oh, see that? Is this for real? What? It flipped out. I didn't think she was that messed up. What the hell? Who is that up there? Oh, no. Kate! Oh! Oh! No. She can't die. She can't. Oh, my God. Not again. Not now. Oh, no, 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 no. I have no. to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. Oh, man. No, 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 no. No. No, 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 
come on. Keep going, Max. You can't do it. Oh, go, go, go. I've like I've frozen time right now. Look at that. There's raindrops in the air. Oh man. Go, 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 go. Oh, this here's this douchebag. The worst person in the world. Alright, here we go, here we go. Yes. Oh man, we made it. I know, right? I can't. No, 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 I can't. I don't have any power. Oh, now I have no. to do this by myself. Did you come oh, to get another Pulitzer shot like yesterday, Max? I only wanted proof that David was harassing you. More like you wanted another shot for the Max Caulfield scrapbook. You want another now? Huh? No, 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 no. Please, Kate. You know me better than that. And I know you don't want to jump, but I do. My life is already over. Kate, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. Oh, that phone I call. Always feel like you really listen. Kate, <sighs> please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. Are you serious? Thank you so much. Oh, the fact man. that you don't care about that video and would come up here to stop me means a lot. about you because I believe you were drugged. We will find out who did this and make them pay. Sounds so persuasive, Max. If only... Kate, I believe you. Will you believe me? Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. Oh, and then everybody man. at Blackwell can post pics of my body. Morty on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Oh, man. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. Oh. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Jeez. Forever. Can we hug on it? No. Nobody cares about what? me. What? Nobody. What? about your brothers they need their sister you don't know me at all max oh I no i only have sisters you never listen because you don't give a damn you will now no 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 oh. no
know this isn't pleasant for any of us, but we have to go over what happened before Miss Marsh, before she did what she did. Officer Barry will be taking notes for the official police. Oh. I'm sure you'll give him your full cooperation. Such a tragedy. But there must be a reason for everything. We need to find out why Kate oh. Marsh would be driven to such desperate action. I thought I had it. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. No what happened today should never way. happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Damn. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through. But Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something Damn, was missed. Damn, you guys. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Wow. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. We're going after Nathan. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're a liar. The field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. Oh, boy. I've been told of this alleged gun incident. And I, got... I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. Boom! See you in court. Do it. Do Excuse it. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and fellow student is dead. And they don't need this forum right now. Yes. I'm I said brothers. Right she now. doesn't have any brothers. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but... I think I can use my power again. A little late. Hmm. Oh, boy. Is there anything new that I can do, I wonder? Let's just roll with it. That we're sticking to it. Screw Nathan. That's it. We're moving forward. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So Man. thank you for coming in. That was crazy. I cannot believe I got that that question wrong. I'm so bummed. I liked Kate. I wanted to help her. Ugh. I just can't believe it. It's like it wasn't even real. Watching her drop like a weight. I really thought I could save her. Like a superhero. I tried. Come on, Max. Do not for a second blame yourself. Kate was on that roof for her reasons, not yours. My hand just reached out. Stop it. 
You were the only one with balls enough to run to the roof. You were the only one who cared. Yeah, I sure made a big fucking difference. Maybe if more people cared, Man. better people than me. You're the best person around. Thanks, Bay. Warren, I screwed up today. I sure did. That makes no logical sense. Warren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? Man. The weather could be a awesome. weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. Whoa. I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week. Warren's the man. I don't want to hear you guys talk shit about Warren. Dump him. Ah, oh, that's all right. What is his deal? He's talking to him. Shut up, Begby. These two douches. This guy. Man. Shut up, Begby. Rip Kate. Damn. Four twenty blaze it. Yeah, I'm not spending that money, Tanner. That's way too much money. Interesting. Episode 2, Out of Time. Yeah, I was out of time. So that was episode 2. Jeez. That was pretty intense. Rip Kate. I tried. I just, uh... I guess I got it wrong. I don't know. It's my story though, so in a way, I got it right. <sighs> I love this game. It's an emotional roller coaster. Jeez.
All right, you guys, I'm going to hit the bathroom one more time, and then I'm going to... I know, I'm so bummed about Kate. I, uh... Right? Like, we were trying so hard to, like, everyone was so mean to her. And then I was the guy that was, or girl, I, Max, I was trying to be there for her, like, be her friend, you know? Man. And then I screwed it up at the end by, like, ugh. I screwed up. I'm gonna play episode three tomorrow night. That's what's so hard about it. Like, I screwed that up. That was on me. Shut up, Spot. Damn. So yeah, I'm gonna hit the bathroom. And then we're going to check out all of this new CSGO stuff. So I'm going to leave you guys with the music and the credits and all that. And I will be right back. Perfect timing. Sounds like the song ended, but it looks like the credits are still going. Oh. Goes to cry in the bathroom. <laughs> oh man, I had to I had to, you know, wipe the tears away. Jeez. Calls Warren sobbing in need of comfort. They fall in love. Uh, Warren. Warren's the man. Don't hate on Warren. Alright, I told Kate to go to the police. I'm in the minority. I answered Kate's call. I'm in the majority. I didn't shoot Frank. I'm in the minority. I couldn't save Kate. I am in the minority. I am in the minority of people who could not save Kate. Are you kidding me? And all of us blame Nathan. Look at that, you watered your plant. That's so crazy. Whoa. can't hear me? You should be able to hear me. Hello! Alright, that's, uh, Chaos Theory is the next episode. Whew. We will play the next episode. Episode 3, Chaos Theory. We'll play that tomorrow night. I'm spreading this out just because it's episode.